Shalom and blessings. What's up, my beautiful people? So today we in South Africa at Sweet Tea and Chicka D. Listen, y'all gonna love this. You don't wanna miss it. Ascension, and don't you forget to mention When y'all say it's your time, watch how they gotta pay attention In the last days without doing anything to be mentioned On the app designed to put your mind in prison This extensive, covered in that cost your soul I'm like, surely it's expensive Shalom, listen y'all So today we was in South Africa at Sweet Tea and Chicken D And listen man, they had some very reasonable prices as y'all can see And man it was so hard for us to find certain food that we are used to from the States. And their food was delicious. So as we're getting into it, I want y'all to check it out. And I want y'all to see, if you're ever in South Africa, Joe Berry to be exact, you have to check out Sweet Tea and Chicka D. Yeah. Hey, hey, don't spill it. No whiskey. This was the only place we could find some real southern cooking. We slide in the spin, we ride. Turn the music up loud, now we about to ride on the summer day. Top drop on Instagram. So we really enjoyed the coffee. Myself, I gave it an 8 out of the 10. The little one, though, she's a little more picky. As you heard on the video, she wasn't really feeling her iced coffee. But as far as the latte, I really enjoyed the latte, my wife as well. So we gave my 8 out of 10. So we ordered fried green tomatoes. Everybody from the South know about fried green tomatoes, as well as fried okra. We thought it was going to be the fried okra that we used to. But it was the fried okra, the whole okra, the long way, as you can see. And um, yeah, it was cool. It was cool. It wasn't what I'm used to. You know, I seen fried okra on the menu. I'm like fried okra. But what really excited me was the pancakes. I have tasted nowhere in Africa. Matter of fact, to me, Africans think pancakes is a dessert. Y'all know for us it's breakfast. So that whole that buttermilk style pancake. Oh man, Sweet Tea and Chickadee had it to the, I mean, they were knocking IHOP out the park. You hear me? IHOP ain't got nothing on Sweet Tea and Chickadee. It was some delicious, and even the syrup, the syrup was on point and excellent. Oh, the eggs were superb. I mean, you could tell they were fresh. Um, everything was on point. It was delicious. This was one of my top places that we had been to eat. And it reminded me so much of real Southern cooking. So if you are ever in South Africa, you got to go check out Sweet Tea and Chicken D. Me, myself, I get Sweet Tea and Chicken D an 8 out of 10 in my restaurant review. Check it out as we continue to vlog Africa. Y'all know what time it is. Moon music. Shalom and blessings to all my people. We'll get back at you with the next one. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and help us fight that algorithm demon by drop kicking and left writing the like button. And leave a comment if you enjoyed the content. We'll get back at you on the next one. Peace and blessings, family. Shalom.